and I tuned in to something super tight. Puffin' something sticky, nigga, I roll through the light Need to hear something real just to get me through the night I'm looking for them jackets cause I know they looking shy Know I'ma get some game tuned in with super tight Yeah, I get that all up from Big Bobo From the front seat, not no photos Already, baby, what it do, what it is It's your big dog, Bobo Luciano I want to thank everybody again for tuning in to Super Tight TV We back up your back, going smack, smack, <laughs> smack Just like that I hope it feel good to you. <laughs> Cause it show sure feel good to me. I got my sexy ass, gorgeous, beautiful wife. Mm. It's your girl Jazzy K. In the building. How you doing, baby? I'm doing good. How about you? You looking good, fresh, got your cannabis shirt on. Thank you. Representing. You know, hey. you know. Your fresh green for the greenery. That's right. Yeah. Today we have a super tight guest. Absolutely. Yeah, man. I've been uh, Following this young lady. Matter of fact, I got a shout out to the homegirl's way. Shout out to Swizzling. I'm talking about. She uh, called me and said, hey, check this out. This is like my my daughter's friend. And she wanted me to check out her page. And I said, oh, she got motion. Yeah. And then I talked to this young lady. And she was telling me everything that she had going on. And mm -hmm. told me something that she had um, in her sights. The next thing I know, I saw a post that she was accomplish that too so yeah. so hey we're gonna talk to her today and find out about it all already today i got the world famous hey 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 judy hey, drama is in the building <laughs> yeah it's judy yeah. Drama, bang yeah. bitch hey judy yeah thanks Hey y'all! Hey, well, thank you for blessing us with your presence. Oh, of course, yeah, yeah. of course. You look good. You look looking good. Look at flossy. Yeah, good skin. Look at her. No, 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 no. So you know, you know how we do it. You know, we like to act like people never heard of you. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Because we have our family of, of of people who have subscribed, and we want to introduce them to Miss. Judy drama for sure you know what I'm saying we like to go down through that yeah. you know what I'm talking about and you know when it's usually a young lady in the house cause I can be abrasive mm -hmm. uh, what's the word you said it animated I can be animated so I like let my wife you know I ain't scared oh, I know you ain't scared I'm gonna join in I'm gonna join in <laughs> but you know I like to watch hold up <laughs> <laughs> Girl. Yeah, get over there. Yeah. Get yeah. over there and watch. Talk Come on, my okay. this little headphones. <laughs> yeah, right, yeah, Miss, already. Miss Judy Drama. Let everybody know where you're from. I'm originally from Long Beach, California. LBC? Hey, West. Okay. Um, but when I was three. Five six two okay, for me, right. you oh, know, five, six, like yeah, yeah. Snoop right. Dogg two one three, but oh, yeah. I'm just hollering out, you know numbers. what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> just hollering out numbers, yeah. But, same, but, I, but I was close. So, I was, you was close. Okay. Same sign. Really. Um, but I grew up in North Dallas. I'm from Royal Lane, the Forest Lane. Okay, what oh, really? age did what age did you move from? Nine. Okay. Yeah. okay. Yeah, yeah. nine years old. Uh, I moved to Dallas, Texas after my father passed away with mm. my mom and my stepdad and. I've been a knife baby ever since. Oh, nine? Your mm -hmm. dad passed nine? Let's talk about Big Fred. Well, he passed when I was seven, but I didn't move to Texas till I was nine. Let's talk about Big Fred. Yeah. You know Big Fred? That's my daddy. Okay, let's talk about <laughs> Big Fred. What's wrong, Judy? It's just the way you said it. I was wrong. I'm like, Judy. that's my dad name. Like, that's that's Big Fred. Fred. Yeah. <laughs> let's talk about Big Fred. <laughs> huh? We can't talk about Big Fred? I was just like, how you know his yeah. name was Big Fred? How you know my dad? No. Hey, you know, <laughs> when we do these kind of jobs and we become journalists. What? Because yeah. because we research. we used to be artists. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? My wife can still go. Yeah. But we have we have dibbled and dabbled and stuck our big toe into this uh, journalistic field. I see. <laughs> so we have to do what journalists do. Research a little bit, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Be prepared for sure. We don't want to. No, this is the fire. Yeah, we what? freestyle, but we we still know. Yeah, up here. Yeah. So tell us about Big Fred. Oh, he was the greatest. Was he best best seven years of my life? First wow. life, you know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? Um, I was I am the only girl of six boys. Mm. Um, Ooh. and um, you couldn't do it, nothing. I could do everything. That's oh. the problem. <laughs> 
That's the problem. I'm not 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 in that yeah, sense, yeah, yeah. but it's just like you know, even my brothers now they cater to me like okay. that's that's my only sister, like you yeah, know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But um, my dad he kind of molded that. Like so, when I deal with men, I'm like, because mm. mm-hmm. oh, yeah. my daddy, I don't mm-hmm. even care mm-hmm. if I was seven. Like yeah. this is what I learned, you know. But he was definitely um, he was definitely that guy. Yes. He was that guy. I knew that from a very early age, and I know that still because now I'm not seven. I'm yeah. grown, grown, and you these really people. Know. When I go yeah. back to California, they be like, "Cause your daddy told me to wow. do this uh-huh. for you, okay, in your big age, okay." Aww. You know, so he had respect sweet. in the streets. Yeah, he was him. That's Already. so sweet. He was him. So, um, give us a fun memory of dad. Oh. Seven years old. <laughs> I ain't gonna say it was fun, but it was like the bring out the best of both of our personalities. Yeah. He was teaching me how to spell red. Mm-hmm. Okay. R E D. And then he was like, now spell Fred. And I couldn't spell it. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, that's that moment. Oh, yeah. <laughs> You're like, I could, if you can spell he red. Was just like, <laughs> spell red. I'm like, R E D. Easy, daddy. <laughs> it's easy. And he was like, not spell Fred. And I'm like, Losing my shit. Oh, like, yeah. I don't know okay. how to get Fred off, man. I don't know what's going on. He, 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 was, no hit? he was so mad. He that's was when, like, that's, Courtney. That's one of them questions <laughs> where you get mad at the kids. You like, Abby <laughs> had four apples. Yeah. <laughs> he gave one to Johnny. <laughs> How many she got How left? Many do- and I'm just like, I'm uh-huh. <laughs> losing my shit. Like, friend, friend. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I'll never forget that. But, you know, that's how I was just like, girl, you might be a little slow. <laughs> just hey, a little bit. But just you know what? But that's funny, though. That's yeah. good that you have memories like that that you could hold on and remember pops by. For sure. Mom, For sure. What, what made y'all move to Texas? Um, So... Like I said, my dad passed when I was seven, and then my mom, she was single. I still had my, you know, mm-hmm. my, my mom and my stepmom had a, a, a decent relationship. Okay. And then they after should. my after my dad passed away, it became more than decent, mm-hmm. you know. Right, but my mom was single. My stepmom was a widow, so she just, you know, she moved to California. She moved to Houston, actually. Shout okay. out to, you know, H-Town. Because oh, really? when I first got to Texas, we was in Houston. Okay. Um, but Houston... Uh, with my mom being from Long Beach to City City, mm-hmm. it wasn't city enough yeah. for her. <laughs> like she was slow. Just, it's a little slow Everything down here. A little slow yeah, down it's a little Texas. slow down here. <laughs> so she actually moved to Dallas. And all of this happened while I still lived with my stepmother in Long Beach. Because oh, wow. like I said, I didn't get to Dallas until I was nine. Oh, wow. So between seven and nine, my mama was recreating yeah. or you know adding on to her I'm life like in space. texas and then you know she met my stepdad and he's from houston and um she, like i said she was like buddy i love you but i i moved to texas just okay. not this part of texas part, yeah, <laughs> you know yeah, yeah. i need something that a little a little more reflection of california so of I course dallas relate. really yeah I can relate. dallas dallas is where we settled that's where we've been mm-hmm. for I don't know since since she was nine. He kept yeah, talking to me about moving out into the boonies. Don't y'all come for me in the comments. <laughs> well, boonies, <laughs> forty I ain't, I ain't gonna say no name. <laughs> okay, yeah. somebody went off on Melissa? me. No, oh, I'm, 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 I'm talking about her because somebody went off on me because I didn't know they looked ten. My bad. Uh, as soon as she said that, I said they're gonna come for you. They gonna time. come for you because we don't. They coming. Dang. Just be prepared. No, yeah. for real. About? He had tried to get me to move to some small. Yeah, know. like mm-mm. what high school did you go to? Ain't no beauty um, supply. I went to Lakeview Centennial High School in uh, Garland. Okay, mm-hmm. all right, Garland. Mm-hmm. Yeah, how was that? It was high school. Okay. <laughs> like, I mean, you know, like I was a little upset because I had spent all of my elementary, middle school in North Dallas. So yeah. you know, I wanted to go to like Highlands, Parkland, all of this uh-huh. other stuff. Then my mom bought a house in garland and at the time of course as a kid i don't realize this is an investment and in mm-hmm. all my friends live in the apartments yes. now i live in a house yeah. i'm like i want to live in an apartment <laughs> and i want to still be a project baby like i don't want to go you yeah, know yeah, yeah. but garland ain't got no hoes like yeah them niggas is like yeah, yeah, yeah. i'm like because growing up you'd be like they from garland oh yeah they from they from the uh, Carrollton, they're from you don't know what I'm saying? Let the like, sweet taste, man. Say, like, I lost my mind in Garland. <laughs> like, oh, <yeah. laughs> 
<laughs> Garland just got one of those. I lost my mind in Garland. It's a good mix. It's out a there. hood everywhere. Yeah, Mexican. You got yeah, yeah. And that's what. Uh, don't even get me started on Mexicans. My love for Mexicans is like the culture, people. Yes. That's my appreciation. Oh, my Garland. Name. Yes. Like yes. I locked in with so many. I can't even say Mexicans because it's different. You know, mm-hmm. yes. Hispanics. Yeah. You know, di- different. Um, they went to Garland. Yeah. yeah. Okay. okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And I don't know. Garland Garland taught me like, hey, North Dallas, South Dallas, Oak Cliff are just not the hoods. <laughs> like they are the hoods, but Garland has their own oh, yeah. situation too. Oh, you mean not the only hoods? They not the only yeah. hoods. Okay. They definitely oh, those places I just named, they're definitely oh, hoods. Yeah. But I'm just saying. That like, don't saying. sleep on they're Garland. Oh, we're not gonna sleep on Garland. <laughs> Please don't sleep on <laughs> no, Garland because no. I about to say I thought Oak Cliff would be no. <laughs> Oak Cliff is definitely the hood. Oh yeah, that's where we definitely from. Definitely the hood because that's my hood. Oh, that's my hood. hood. Don't, Don't put it in my face. Okay, it's understood. Yeah, it's, I got yeah, it. Yeah, 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 yeah. I, got it. I got it. I got it. I know the song. O A K C. I'm that part. It's your girl Jazzy K with Super Tight TV. We want to thank everyone that's been watching. Hey, if you do us a favor and hit that subscribe button, also press the notification bell so you can be notified every time we drop a new video. No, I'm gonna get some game tuned in with super tight. Yeah, I get the low love from Big Bobo from the front seat, not no photos.